Hey guys and welcome to this elite tutorial for face. Before you start this tutorial you don't need any monkey knowledge points but I highly recommend to have the paragon power one because it makes tier 5 way way easier. The start here is pretty simple because we are using Obin as our main defense before tier 1 and we are going to build 4 two zero zero farms. Now place down an engineer monkey and upgrade your engineer monkey as always to oversized nails and pin. Upgrade three of your farms now to marketplace. Defend the camo balloons by using Obin's ability and upgrade your engineer monkey to larger service area, double gun and balloon trap. Upgrade your last farm to a marketplace. Place down one more farm and upgrade that farm also to greater production and marketplace. Place down an alchemist on last, upgrade your alchemist to larger potions and rubber to gold. Place down a glue gunner, upgrade your glue gunner to bigger globs and stronger glue and put him on last as well. Okay, so tier 1 takes about 10 rounds, so before you start your tier 1, please watch mine one time so you know what to do. We are basically using our normal strategy, we are going for a monkeyopolis and also for an elite defender as our main DPS. You know what to do, switch between strong and first as much as you can, try to stay on strong as long as possible and try to not leak a single balloon unless it's only a red up to a yellow one so you can trigger the passive ability and gain 4 times the attack speed. If Face is using his portal, you can always use your engineer trap and place the trap just above the portal so it can collect more balloons. Farming wise, we are just going for as many marketplaces as possible, all of them in range of your monkeyopolis. If you don't have enough range, upgrade to bigger radius or put another village in range of your monkeyopolis to increase its radius.
After five farms, you can get jungle drums and you can also place down a 3 to 0 alchemist in range of your elite defender to buff it. Don't forget to always switch your engineer's traps as much as possible next to or on the portal and if you have enough money you can upgrade one of your marketplaces to a central marketplace. Be very careful with round 49, I highly recommend to keep your sniper here on first instead of strong because you may leak a balloon if you stay on strong. Alright, after tier 1 is defeated, you can sell your elite defender and your alchemist and you can get um, two engineer balloon traps. Sell one of your marketplaces for a BRF farm and also get a cleansing foam for camo detection and upgrade your cleansing foam as soon as possible to overclock to overclock your BRF farm, just as we did on normal. For more defense we are going for a 2-3-0 wizard um, next to your monkeyopolis. At this point you can upgrade all of your marked places to central markets. In round 56 you should have enough money to sell all of your marketplaces and get your tier 5 banana central. Do not forget to always overclock it because this will make a lot of money. Place down 4 more marketplaces now and for round 59 um, it can get a little bit scary because of the camo lead balloons. So I highly recommend to place down a 0-2-2 wizard monkey in the bag just in case. Alright, for tier 2 we are going to use an MAD and we are also need to sell some of our marketplaces to afford it. Um, if you can't get it right away just keep your marketplaces for round 60 and after round 60 just um, sell all of your marketplaces and get your MAD. Try to place down as many BRF farms now as possible uh, while you are aiming your MAD on top of face and for round 63 and also for round 65 place down 4 0 3, 2 wizard monkeys in the bag. Do not forget to place down 4.
After tier 2 is done, you can sell all of your defense and as always get a 150 Spirit of the Forest. Do not forget to use its ability to generate some lives and extra cash. At this point place down 4 overclocks so you have 5 in total, 1 for each farm. Make sure to always overclock it, this is, this is by far the most important thing for money. For extra money, start placing down 140 Druids as much as you can in range of all your BRF farms. After your druids you can start placing down snipers, make sure all of them are in range of a monkey city so they generate extra cash. After placing down as many snipers as you can, you can start placing down helis in range also of monkey cities to generate cash. Against tier 3 we want to have a degree 20 boomerang paragon, we can do this by placing down at least 25 220 boomerang monkeys. Get your boomerang paragon as soon as possible and you can also keep him after defeating tier 3. If you have enough money after getting your Paragon, you can sell one of your BRF farms to get a Monkey Wall Street and if you have even more money, you can sell one of your BRF farms to get a Monkey Nomics. Do not forget to always collect your bank. You can also go for the bottom pass so it auto collects but it will make a little bit less money and also make sure to always use its ability. After tier 3, place down your tier 5 ninja monkeys and also your tier 5 wizard monkeys. Make sure to always use your ninja grand sabos ability for extra cash generation. Um, no, for extra pops, I'm stupid. For extra pops and yeah, that's basically it. At tier 4 you should now get um, your degree 30 plus ninja paragon 
by placing down at least 20 4 to 0 ninjas and putting all of your money into your ninja paragon. For D5 we are going for a degree 20 Dart Paragon and we are also going for the highest degree possible Wizard Paragon. And guys T5 is very very close so please try to use your Wizard ability as good as possible. Always make sure you have full mana before you use your ability and just pray. If you don't have the monkey knowledge I highly recommend to maybe use a power here to increase all of your Paragon's attack speed because you will see at the end it's going to be very very close i died one time and uh, yeah you can avoid this by having a the monkey knowledge point or b using for example monkey boost or time stop abilities to do more damage i hope this guide helped you if it did please leave a like and subscribe i hope you have a very great weekend i see you guys very soon for the rank guide and yeah bye thanks for watching